Hello everyone, this is Cat Fan Comics Man back with a new comic book day for November 24th. Um, starting to get caught up on my comics. Marvel is still pushed a lot, but I did receive some more comics this week, so I'll start off here. Let's see, I got X Force number 25. The Native American Heritage Month by Wolf. Variant cover. It's a pretty cool cover. Then I got my Moon Knight number five variant cover. I like this cover. I like the colors. I like the yellow with the Moon Knight in front. I think it looks cool. Then I picked up a new number one that came out. Joy Operations by Dark Horse. The uh, local comic shop day variant number one. Haven't been able to read it yet, but kind of excited to read that one. Then next, of course, by Boom, I picked up House of Slaughter, number two. And then, of course, House of Slaughter, number two, cover A. Then Harbinger number two. This one's by Valiant. Then finally they released Black Cat number one, cover A. Then I'm not too sure why I picked these up, but I thought they might be interesting. I picked up Watch Dogs Legion, number one, cover A. And then I picked up Watch Dog Legion's number one, cover C or D, one of the two. I do like this cover, though. Then, due to the diamond mishap, I didn't get all my comics from last week. So here's Primordial, number two. I finally received it. Number three, excuse me. I'm a week late on reading it, so... <laughs> And then last but not least for this haul, Hulk number one, cover A. I am not sure why yet, but I didn't receive my good boy. I picked up cover A and cover B of it, and I think there was a couple other ones too. I'm also waiting on a huge order from Economics and Comics. But I offered to pay extra shipping, but he's holding on to them until they all come in. So I've got comics there for the last three weeks. Well, it's been, let's see, what, almost a month and three weeks since I ordered. And I won't be getting them until mid-December to January. So I'm going to be way behind on X-Men and I'm going to be way behind on Doctor Strange and all of those. So, I hate that. That's why I kind of like Impulse Creations here in Tulsa. Because uh, as long as I order weekly, they're shipping me out comics every week. And they're just shipping me out as they get them. So that way I always have comics to read every week. And I appreciate that. And I think they're really great of a company for doing that for me. So, 
Thank you, Impulse Creations. Of course, I also want to say thank you to Billy from Economics and Comics, because he does do the best he can, considering he's a one-man operation. Um, it just really sucks on my end, but, you know, what can you do? It's a small business, and he's doing the best he can. But, um, anyway, thanks again. Thanks a lot. I guess I'll do the usual and say smash that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment down below and tell me what you think of my choices, and hope you all have a great Thanksgiving, and I hope you all have a great weekend, and I will see you in the next video.